Welcome back to Halo Canon everyone for another close look at Halo 5's maps. Today we'll be looking at Regret. Regret is a remix of Truth, essentially the same map with some new slash slightly different geometry. From the sprint, we know that Regret is one of the ships from the fleet of particular justice that crashed on the Halo ring. Now, whether this is the same ship as Truth is unknown, and probably will remain unknown until Halo 5 comes out, or until we get proper map descriptions. The big thing that people will most likely notice first with this map is that it is literally covered in bugs. Big ass beetles, to be precise. Whether these beetles are something that was native to the ring, or something that was on the ship when it crashed, in the same way that we see bugs throughout High Charity in Halo 2, is unknown, but I would probably guess the former. If it is the former, this would mark the second official sighting of fauna on the Halo ring, the first being the Quad Wings. Speaking of the ring, I have not been able to spot it at all when I've played on Regret. I've heard that you can see part of it in the sky, but I've personally never been able to spot it. The final thing of note is the new weapon, the Hydra. The Hydra is a human weapon reminiscent of the Plasma Launcher from Halo Reach. Like the Plasma Launcher, it can lock onto enemy targets. Unlike the Plasma Launcher, you don't have to charge it up, and you can fire missiles individually instead of en masse. And that pretty much wraps up Regret. Before we go, I want to share a little something else on Truth that I missed out on, and that many of you pointed out to me. In one of the lower areas of the map, you can see a hologram of a prophet speaking in what sounds like Sanghili, though it could also be San Shayun. Given the lore surrounding Truth, I can't help but wonder if this might be the Prophet of Stewardship, a minor prophet attached to the fleet. The only problem is that Halo the Flood states that Stewardship used an anti-gravity belt instead of a gravity throne. Given that, this hologram prophet could be another prophet who was attached to the fleet. The two other known are the Minister of Etiology, the Legate from the Halo graphic novel, and the Prophet of Clarity, Zoreskin, from Halo Broken Circle. However, the Prophet of Stewardship was the highest ranking San Shayum within the fleet, so I'm still more inclined to think this hologram is him. Add to that his resemblance of the Prophet seen here speaking to Thel Vadim from Halo 2 Anniversary's Terminals, and it would seem to be an open and shut case. It would seem. Anyway, that's all for today. In coming videos, I will be covering two maps at a time given the lack of definitive lore material to work with. The final Halo 5 beta video will take a look at the weapons, new and old, seen throughout the beta. Hopefully I'll be a little more diligent with the remaining videos than I have with this one. Anyway, thanks for watching as always. For now, this has been Halo Cannon. See you next time. Game over. Victory. Weapon pads ready. Shield recharge. Hey guys, thanks for watching my video. It means more than I could express in a few minutes of audio. If you did like it, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, share it around on whatever social media you see fit and all that jazz. Thank you so much. Your support is everything. I would not be where I am without you. Thanks.